Beggars can't be choosers, but beggars never quit. Height here, and you already know what this is. It's time for choosing beggars, but with a twist. A blast from the past with Walk Back Wednesday. Let's do it. Our first one is from The Farting King 56. Hi, anyone here giving away a free, new or like new Chrysler 200 2015 to 2017? My 16 year old daughter turned down $3,000 for a new vehicle because the car that her grandpa was trying to sell her was pretty crappy. Also, I need it as soon as possible. Thanks. You need to leave now. This group is not for this. It is for people who are actually in need of financial help. If you actually read, most posts here are about people who usually don't have enough money to even buy a full meal. Maybe you should rename your group. You are giving people false information. I thought this was a support group, idiot. It is a support group for people in need of financial help, not somebody who has a daughter that's ungrateful with the kind of car she could get. This next one is by MISC Lisa. Would there be anyone willing to help me get stuff to drink for my kids tonight, please? Like case or cases of soda, Dr. Pepper preferably, and juice and Gatorade if possible. Store brands are half price of name brand. I'm not trying to be mean, but weren't you asking for necessities earlier? Now you're wanting sodas? Prioritize. <laughs> Telling a beggar to prioritize, well, prioritizing is not really their strong suit. That's evident by the fact that they want things free and that's at the top of their priority list. This next one is from Livy Love. Can anyone watch my son Monday through Thursday from a little after 5 a.m. until 3.30ish? He's a handful, but I'm working on getting him tested to figure out what's going on. I could pay $50 a week and provide food and drinks for him. The only reason I can only afford $50 is because I'm a single mom, basically trying to do it all on my own. I would really appreciate it, preferably someone that lives in Beggarsville. Look, I get it. Being a single parent isn't easy. I know because I am one and like you, I'm doing everything all on my own, but you don't see me asking for handouts either. What I end up doing is sacrificing something that I would give to myself to make sure my child doesn't go without. Maybe if you prioritize, you would be able to afford to pay somebody a little bit more to care for your child. This next one is from Thesis Yes. My school is looking for a photographer for our Christmas party. But the thing is, you're going to pay us. You'll pay us to photograph people. Then you can use our party as a market or something. Am I making sense? <laughs> you're not making any sense at all. No beggar, you're not making any sense at all to sane people. Maybe to other beggars, you make 100% perfect sense. But really, do you think that somebody's going to take the time to photograph people at your party, most likely give you the photos all for free so they can use the party as a platform? <laughs> no. This next one is by Mush Tilly. Hi, I saw your posts on Instagram and I love them. So since I print and frame photos for people and you're a photographer, maybe we can team up or something. Thanks for your interest. That sounds great. So what were you thinking? Here's my idea. You can send me some pics without the watermarks and I can print and sell them. Then we split the profits? No. Then how do I benefit? I'll give you credit and exposure. I have more than three times your followers, so I think it'll help you. How does that sound? No, I'm not going to give you images that I normally sell for free so you can make a profit off them just for some exposure to your 3,500 followers. If you want to be selfish and not share your talents with others, that's fine by me. Okay, great. But God will definitely never forgive these sins. <sighs> if you don't change your ways, you'll go to hell. <sighs> I'll save you a spot. Okay, Beggy, let me reverse the card for you. You're trying to say that God won't forgive their sins for not wanting to do something for free for you. What about your sins for being bigger than them, bragging about it, and being able to help them but choosing not to because you don't get to benefit from it? 
<laughs> I'm pretty sure your sins are worse. This next one is from Norskit. Hello, are you the selling a gaming PC? I'm interested. Yeah, it's an i5 7th gen GTX 1060 16GB RAM computer. My asking price is $700. I could do $600 if you got it today. Okay, listen man, I need that computer because I need to make a Fortnite YouTube channel. So, I need the PC delivered free. But do not worry, I give you a shout out. If you don't, I will call 911 and get you arrested. Give your mom her phone back. But why? Please, computer, I shout you out or else. <laughs> no. Bro, do how I beg you. I will call 911 and they will cuff you if you don't give it now. Answer, okay? I guess cops will arrest you. Answer. The police don't go and arrest people just because they don't want to sell something to somebody else for a ridiculous price or, oh wait, I'm sorry, in your case it's not even selling, <laughs> you want it for free. Doesn't work, buddy. This next one is by Missy Town. Who can help me build a chicken coop per Volusia County Backyard Chicken Code? I live in the county in Orange City. Only five hens per county ordinance. $134 permit fee, application fee, take a chicken class, $10. Notify via certified mail adjacent property owners of your intent to have chickens, $8.20. And draw out and submit specs of coop with run, 120 square feet, does not require a building permit, over this does. So, I'm looking for a reliable Christian that has some muscle and carpentry skills and tools. I will buy materials and help build and I'm guessing it will take half a day to complete. Need this done within the next week. Can be on a Thursday or Friday starting at 9 or 10 a.m. or any other day of the week or weekend starting at 4 p.m. Please message me. Christian women who would allow their Christian husbands to help a Christian single parent out. Thank you and God bless. They're listing all of these fees and they're not stating that they'll pay those fees so it's only leading me to believe that they want the good Christian man to also pay the fees as well which I don't think they're going to be willing to do. This next one is by Sernando138. As a small business owner, I come across people that belong on this sub every day, but this one really got to me. This dude I know was pissed he didn't get any extra hookups the other day, and he came down to tell me in person. Granted, when things were normal, I would throw in a couple extra wings or fries for regular buds on a busy night. Common practice. But things are obviously different these days. My profits are stretched even thinner, so no more freebies. At least way less. This dude is also in the industry and should know this. I explained this to him and he said it was messed up and that next time he ordered to please be sure to make it worth my while. Seriously? I told him to just not bother ordering anymore until he figures out why he's being an ass. That's probably the best course of action, honestly, if he's not willing to understand the situation, understand what's going on, and why he can't get the freebies he oh so seeks, then it's probably best not to serve him. And our final one is from Grazzy Peach. Hello, I really like your art and was wondering if you could draw something for me. <laughs> I'd like this character done in a YouTube banner format. I look forward to hearing your reply. I don't do commissions, sorry. Oh, I wasn't asking for a commission. Sorry for the confusion. I figured you could do it for free since it'd be seen by a bunch of different people. You'd get more followers that way. <laughs> I don't do requests or freebies either, sorry. Okay, what the hell? Look, I'm trying to do you a favor here, so just roll with it. It's just one drawing. I was asking nicely and everything. There's no reason for you to be like this. You're being very unprofessional for someone of your caliber, you know? I mean, really? I just get one sentence? Am I that unworthy of your time? I didn't realize I had to make an appointment to be graced with your presence. 
How do you expect to gain anything from being so casual and carefree? You'll never become popular if you don't start giving back to the people that show support for you and your work. You'll never get anywhere in this industry either. But fine, whatever, it's your loss. You keep being you, an informal bitch. Let's see how far that gets you in the art world. I'm not a professional, sorry. Fuck you! I'm asexual, sorry. <laughs> That's the greatest way to come back to a beggar that just can't seem to take no for an answer. When will they understand that artists don't owe them anything and they don't want to work for free? Alright. That's enough beggars for the day. Well, that wraps up this episode of Choosing Beggars. If you liked the video, please drop a like, share my content on all of your social media, subscribe if you haven't already, and make sure to hit that bell. It really helps my channel grow. And drop a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Thanks to my patrons. Have a great day and stay safe out there.